Good morning. Happy Tuesday, guys. We got our 45 minutes Legree inspired workout. We're gonna slow things down today. We're gonna hit all those resistance muscles. So I'll go over equipment. We got gliders. We got some booty bands. And then I also have a very, very light set of hand weights. So good morning. Hey, you guys. Everyone popping in. How are we? Is everyone having a great start to their April? Whew. First week of April, we're into this here. All right. Hey guys, so as you guys are popping in, my name is Meg, what's up? Uh, so we've been doing this well over a year now. If you're just jumping in, if this is your first class, if this is your 100th class, welcome, welcome. I'm so excited to get our bodies moving together, focus into our breath, focus into just mindful movement uh, to get our day going. So good morning, this is your self care time. So let's check in for that here. Equipment. Today, we're going with some equipment right here. I got you guys. So I have a set of gliders, pair of gliders, fuzzy socks, something that you have that can move across the floor. Grab a towel, whatever that is. But we're gonna be moving into a set of gliders. And then as far as bands go, I have a heavier fabric band right here. You can place around the quads. We're gonna be getting into the booty nice and good today. So, and then uh, also I have a light band right here. You can tell when it's starting to fade off, but that light booty band as well. So these are gonna be used into our low body today. A Little bit of upper body love, not a ton. Uh, we're gonna get that upper body super strong tomorrow. So when we are in upper body today, I'm gonna ask that you find, pick up two water bottles, pick up two of your kids or dog toys that are like around two pounds if you don't have like light hand weights. These are just two pounds that I'm gonna be moving with today. So when we hit our upper body, it's also gonna be into our core. We're actually gonna start with it today so that when we can shake out those legs, we're gonna get our abs and arms out of the way in the beginning, and then we'll get into those obliques and legs for the majority of the workout. Um, so yeah, with those, place them on back, back towards the edge of your mat. We got about 60 seconds, and we will take on off right here. So again, light set of hand weights, booty bands, grab them, and gliders. I have, I'm like shedding right now. Does anyone else like feel like you like, there's different times of the month that you just like shed more. So if I'm like picking off little hairs, I've been doing this like all morning. I'm just losing hair right now, apparently. <laughs> okay, guys. So here we are, everyone popped in. You know the drill to top down, drop down your comments. All you're gonna do is tap the very center of your screen and it'll send all those comments on down to the bottom. We'll be moving above those there and then we will get this time for you. If you are popping in, yes, I will save this. So if you guys love the workout, you know the drill. Save it, share it, tag a friend, um, and let's get moving. Okay, I'm gonna slide you guys down half an inch. I'm just ready to like get into this workout. All right, if you're feeling the same, if you can hear me, if you can hear the music, go ahead and shoot me up a thumbs up. What's up, Argentina? I love it, I love it. All right. So if you can hear me, if you can hear the music, I'm gonna turn it up a little bit, and then we're gonna have that workout going. Give me that thumbs up, and we'll move. Woo. Okay. Perfect, perfect. All right, here we go. Thank you, Alex, thank you guys. Okay, let's do this thing. Again, we're starting with light hand weights. Grab those light hand weights, meet me back onto your mat, we're gonna slowly roll ourselves on down in eight. So shake it on out, do what you gotta do. Time is on, 45 minutes, starts now. In three, two, one, start that slow roll all the way down. Hover the shoulder blades, exhale, big lift up. Reach, stop before you come to a full sit up, and then roll it right back down. Now, your sit up, this range of motion, it could look a little bit different for each and every one of us. Some of us, we're gonna roll right about here, and that's gonna be the furthest we can go to without those heels lifting, and then come right back up. You have a two to three inch movement, that's perfect. I would rather have you do that than be coming down here, and then not being able to keep your slow tempo. There's two things that are gonna be the main changers for this 
style of workout. It's going to be your range of motion. So it's going to be that once we're into a movement, as you see, there's no like stop or finish to the movement. You are working the entire time. We're just switching directions within that muscle engaged, your core engaged. The other thing you're going to use today is your tempo. So your range of motion and your tempo, those are going to keep you honest to those woo, small twitch muscles. So that tempo right here, it's slow, slow. Breathe, hover, hold. Exhale, right back up. Okay, settle in right here. Your time. Shake off anything in the morning. If it took whatever this morning, it might have gone perfectly planned. Odds are there were some things that you wish could have been a little bit different, but either way, it got you to this space. It got you to be in this present moment all together. We got 10 seconds left. We're gonna hold it halfway. Coming up, right here in five, four, three, two, one. Turn those palms on up. We're gonna find some gratitude for that everybody. Open the arms wide. Squeeze, pull them right back in. Out, two, three, pull. Pull them in, two, three, and pause it again, reach out. Remember I said we're hitting that upper body first. It's gonna be involved with the core. Squeeze, palms stay up right here, reach out. Breathe. Exhale, pull it in. Yes. If you're starting to feel this into the neck, into the shoulders, go ahead and sit up just a little bit more. That's going to be that core control where we're eventually going to be able to hold right here without any tension into the neck by being able to pull down that posture. Pull your shoulders away from the ears. Hug the flats on in. Reach out. Breathe. Woo. Take it right back in. All right, these arms are gonna stay the same, but we're gonna add in the legs. You go upside down there, but keep those palms turned up to the ceiling. Ready? Draw your knees on in. In, roll to that back, hold, hover here, meet me here. Toes are pointed down, you want that 90 degrees. Palms up, inhale, reach, out, extend, hold, exhale, sweep, pull on in, reach and breathe. Inhale, out, inhale, out. Don't let those arms drop.
down, 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 elbows up, drop those gold crusher, exhale, push up, last one. All right, friends, hold it just back halfway. Woo. We go tailbone angel in three, two, one. Hold and hover onto that tailbone angel. Open up the arms wide, slowly sweep on in. Now, as we open wide, I want you to lengthen out the legs. Sweep, draw in, stop the hands above the shins, inhale. Reach, two, hold, exhale, sweep. Again, big open. For four, three, two, hold. Exhale, take it right back in. At any point in time, if you need to drop those heels, you can do that. Maybe you practice with just one balance starting on one side, and then you can add in that second leg. As you find that point, stare into a point in the wall. You pick your space and breathe through it right here. Inhale, take it out. Inhale, pull the shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, scoop right back on in. Arms should be starting to get that nice little shake. Let's go. Reach, reach. Woo. Breathe in, pause. Exhale, take it right back on in. Scoop and lift. Arm circles are coming up in 10. Next time you meet me, all the way back out. Arms out to that T. We circle, start arm circles forward in three, two, pause ceiling, circle forward for 10, 9, 8, 7, woo, 6, 5, we switch in 4, 3, 2, switch that direction for 10, 9, 8, woo, 7, 6, get ready, we find a superman, lay on that belly in 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1, come on forward, lay onto the belly, keep those hand weights right here, extending out. Reach those arms out nice and long. Reach. I want you to pull all the way back and in and squeeze. Squeeze those toes, inner thighs, ankles. Lift the quads away from the mat. Inhale. Reach on out. Hover, hold. Exhale, pull right back on in. But now my thumbs are pointed up to the ceiling right here. So that as you're holding, it's that soft little ballerina bend into the elbows as you reach over high. Squeeze all the way up. Flex and crunch into the lumbar part of your spine. Inhale, look to the mat. Exhale. We're never letting that chest fully drop, nor the legs fully come down onto the floor. Keep that constant fight. Breathe. Pull and squeeze. Hug into the back. Hug into the lats. Pull the elbows back like they're going to touch the top of the hip bones. Reach on out. Lengthen, pause. Exhale, pull it out. We swim it out in eight, seven, six, five. Get ready. Hold it, little swimmers with the hands and legs. Let's go, let's go. Last ten. Nine, eight, seven. You're going to meet me in a high plank position. In five, four, three, two. Set those weights down. Come shot up into a nice high plank. Hold, hold. All right, friends. Upper body is done. Let's get into that. Four, Woo. and we'll work it. Roll the shoulders out of the ears. Cross down into the hands. Squeeze on nice and strong. Now just holding this plank right here. Shoulders are warm, shoulders are active. Lats are engaged, pull and squeeze them in tight. Scoop the top of the hips in towards the base of the ribs. Feel a stretch along the back of the calf. Back of the legs, lengthen out the spine. We're here, 15 seconds left. Hold. Breathe. So dang good. We're gonna find those gliders. We got a wheelbarrow. Grab those gliders underneath the hands. In four, three, two, and one. Go ahead and roll that mat on up halfway if that's gonna be for you. I'm probably gonna lead mine up halfway. Drop your knees onto your mat. Hands come to the gliders. Kneeling push up position right here. Inhale, push on out one glider. Reach, hold. Exhale. Pull right back in. You're like, Megan, I thought you said we were done with arms. I know. They're supporting here. Lean the weight into the front arm that's extending. Pull back in. Find the upper abdominals. Level two, both hands reach. Wheelbarrow out. Two, three, hold. Exhale, pull in. Two, three, stop before the hands come underneath the shoulders. Now, a lot of time in the wheelbarrow, the number one thing that I'll see 
where you're going to be like, I'm not feeling this at all, is if you're doing this. If you're pulling back through those hips, I don't want to see that. Right here. Everything from here down stays still. It's frozen. Right here, we're just moving from the shoulders. Hinge out like a door. Open the door. And then pull back underneath. Squeeze and hold. Again, right here. Go reach. Looking just past the fingertips. Exhale, pull in. Stop before the hands come under the shoulders. Do it again. Inhale, lengthen out. Pull, pause. Exhale, pull right back in. Squeeze and breathe. Woo! All right. Eight seconds left. Halfway, hold. In four, three, two, hold it out. Halfway, little reaches out, right hold. Bring it in, hold, pause. Left goes. Out, hold. In, hold, pause. Push both hands out one more inch. Same thing, ready? Right, extends an inch. Pull it in an inch. Left extends an inch. Pull it in an inch. Both hands out one more inch. Last time. Right goes out. Woo! Pull it in. Left goes out. Pull it in. Heels come in in three. Super crunch in two. One. All right. Both heels coming onto one glider right here. Set the other one away for just a second. Sit back onto the tailbone. Lock the inner thighs, ankles together. Inhale, taking it out. Extend those legs out. Pause. Exhale, pull on in. Similar to when we had those weights with the upper body, but now you're pushing your heels down into that disc, down into that glider, so that as it slides and pulls across the floor, your low abs are working as well. If you're feeling this a lot into the hip flexors and you have a pillow or something that you can put in between the knees, squeeze in into it here. I love like a little pillow. You can roll up a ball, a towel, whatever it is, but something if you're really, really feeling those inner thighs and those hip or those hip flexors drop in, that's a great option. Get the shoulders away from the air, slowly take it down. Exhale, pulling in. Stop before you sit at the top. Take it right back down and breathe. Lengthen. Exhale, pull right back up. You ready? Halfway hold in four. Three. Two right here. Just the upper body. Up one hold. Out one hold. Just the lower body. Out one hold. In one pause. Upper body. Up one. Sit it back one. Legs. Out one. Take them in one. Again, three more. Big lift. Lower down. Legs go on out. Woo! Squeeze them in again. Chin off that chest. Lift up. Take it down. Heels go out. Cross away. Drop the heels into the floor. Pull. Add that tension. Push down into that disc the whole time. Last one. Reach it out. Woo! Hold it here for eight, seven, six, five, four. We get ready. Woo! We got curtsies in three, two, one. Standing on up. Here we go. Right foot comes on into the mat. Left foot to your glider. Take your right foot forward. Place the left toe onto your glider right here. Square yourself out to the mat. Drop the back knee. Hit that curtsy. Hold and pause. Right here. Hold at the bottom. Meet with me right here. Square the hips. Squeeze the inner thighs towards each other. Stand. Come up just that 80% of the way. Pause. We're finding in to that outer glute, that abductor. Hold, 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 hold. Exhale, stand right arm up and through. So if you're looking dead onto me right here, hips are going to stay square. The back knee lightly drops. What I don't want to see is a huge drop out with this front knee. Keep it like you imagine crossing your leg over at the bottom of the chair and then keeping that engagement in through the inner thigh. Use your abs in tight. Take it right back down. Slow, slow. Hold and pause. Exhale, coming up. Breathe, stop before the top. Do it again. Get low, keep that back heel up. Exhale, stand on up. We're just getting into the legs. This right leg is nice and fresh right here. So it's harder when you're just starting those leg exercises. Sometimes it's hard to pinpoint what is the exact working muscle. So when you take your hand just to the outside of the booty, I want this to get tighter underneath your fingertip as you come down. Now squeeze it, make it into a fist as you rise. Come on up, 
Soft bend into the right knee. Do it again. Drop low. Go low. Low. The more straight you can keep that back leg amazing, but I do want a small bend at the back of it so that you're still sitting into that low right knee. Slowly climbing up. Are you ready? Holding down in five. Take it down in four. Draw that knee to the back of the calf in three, two, one. Take it in. Two, three, hold. Take it right back out. Big cross. Reach. Good. So I'm crossing behind. Knee is coming to the outside of the right calf. Push it on out. Breathe. All right. We're going to emphasize this outer glute, outer thigh work. Like squat in eight, seven, six, five, four, pull it in three, two, come up just halfway. Do not lock out that right leg. Bring the left toe back behind you. Drop it down, single leg squat. Slowly climb on up, breathe through. So I'm gonna go ahead, face this direction right here. So that we are sitting back and away. Into that single leg squat, holding. Chest is holding, core is holding. Weight is staying into the outside of that right heel. So that as you come down, shoulder, everything stacked over the right side. Slowly climbing up. Squeeze, abs come in, breathe. Light tippy toe onto your glider. Push it away. Hold, pause. Exhale, slowly climbing up. Beautiful. So again, right here, let's work together. All the way down, all the way down. Hold. Climb on through. Woo. Now, I know you're feeling that outer glute right there. It's not as pinpointed as your curtsy. We're engaging more of the outer thigh. We're fighting the inner thighs as well as they're having to lift and pull together at the top. Sit back. Sit left. Squeeze up. Breathe. Your left toe is just so light onto that glider. Push it away. Push it away. Hold back and down. Exhale, pull up. And breathe. Ready? Hold it low. Skate in three, two, one. Bend that knee in. Bend it in. Hold and pause. So here's where we're moving here. We're pushing out. Out. Reach and pause. Scoot back in. Breathe. Hold those out. Yes, there we go. Push out. Breathe. Woo! Pull it in. Sink one inch lower. Again, push it out. Go reach. Reach. You got eight seconds left. When we go back to full range, add the upper body in four. Reach it out in three, two, hold it, hold it, slowly climb up for four. Climb up three, two, stop before the top, do it again. Take it right back down. Breathe, breathe, hold, pause, exhale, pull right back up. Woo! Squeeze it up. Again, we're right back down, let's go low, low. Amazing job, hold it, hold it. Slowly standing through. We're gonna break on up our legs with some obliques and then we're gonna get into our heavier pushing legs. So fight with it here, we got eight. Get low, seven, six, five, forward going, single-sided dancing bear in three, two, one. Take your hands on down to your mat right here. Hands come down, toes come back onto the glider. Level one, just the right foot onto your glider. Twist on over, right knee, left elbow. Slowly push it out, reach, pause out through center. Next time you come over, squeeze on in, squeeze on in, find that right oblique. Level two, take your second foot, match it, pair it to that glider, draw the knees in to the left elbow. Without lifting those hips, I want you to imagine you're in like an air duct right here where you're having to hold in this. This is the ceiling. So as you pull in, hip stay shoulder height. Inhale, take it out. Press on out. Breathe. Exhale right back in. So good, so good. Take it out. Woo! Breathe. Push out and away. Again, big twist. Pull. Squeeze. Pull. It out. Lengthen. Amazing job. You're here. 15 seconds left. Can you get in just two more? You gotta go slow. Cover the shins over the floor. Push on out. 
reach and breathe. Last one, last one. Woo! And five, and four. Grab that hand, we burn it. Three, two, one. Left knee comes on down. Pick up the light hand weight. Left knee down, right toe points out. Reach up. Lengthen down. Shake it up. Now, let's put this upper body to work. Drop down. Reach over. Reach to the sky. Lift up. That's your movement here. Reach. Overhead. Back up tall. Lift for two. Lower hold. Big reach, big reach. Back to the ceiling. If at any point that hand moves too much, you ditch it. Just move with the body weight. Either way, right here. Right toe. This is my right foot. This is my right hand to the ceiling. And I can feel that right oblique. Have to hold out. Breathe. Hold the abs in. Lift up and squeeze. 15 seconds left. No holds. No pulses. We're going to find the light band. Placing it around the feet. Woo! We're on banded bicycles coming up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Take your light band. Place it around the feet. You guys are crushing it. Keep going. Keep going. Quick transition. Take those feet into that band. Take your left foot. Out the way. Press it. Right is in. Take those hands. Push them in together. Reach over that right side. Three, two, take it in. Squeeze, hold. Take it right back out. Center, pause. Big squeeze, squeeze, reach. Take it right back out. Center, pause. Exhale, big reach. My left, my right knee is coming over that left shoulder. Crossing over, folding into the right oblique. Keeping the shoulder blades up. You can drop that heel. It might even make it a little bit tighter. So when I dropped my heel, it actually made it this band more, have a little bit more tension, which I'm gonna use to really fire into that right oblique, right back in center. Press your palms together, big pull, reach, squeeze. So if you need to lighten it up, you might take that balance challenge or push, or if you got really long legs. I'm five, five. Five, three, or five, five, and three quarters on a really good day. Pull it all the way over, squeeze. Take it right back out, dropping that heel right here, because I want that out of tension. Last 10 seconds, go. Reach over, press, press. We're here for eight, Woo. seven, going right into bungee kicks. In six, five, four, three, two, one. One. All I'm gonna do is slide it onto the front of my left ankle. The center is gonna still stay onto the center of the right foot. Find a tabletop onto your mat. Forearms come down, heel to the ceiling. In three, two, and one. Push up, take it down and inch in, pause. I've got big props go up. My heel's going to the ceiling. Stop at 90, exhale, push back up. Drive and hold. Inhale. Exhale, cross away. Turn the toes to the floor. Woo, shoulders out of the ears. Again, big reach. Reach. Lift. Take it right back down. Stop that knee and some hip height. Exhale, big lift. Woo. All right, let's get those booties going right here. Maybe you close those eyes. Maybe you recenter right back to why you cleared this time? Why you picked this workout this morning for you? You chose it. As much as I can lead through a screen, you are doing this yourself. This is self-motivation. You got yourself here. You are holding yourself accountable right now. You and nobody else. Do it for you. Do it for your reasons. Breathe it in. Hold it off of the top in four. Three, two, hold it. Hand straight. Curls extended out. Straight. Hold in, pause, exhale, pull in, bend. 90, pause, lift up an inch. Do it again. Reach out for four, three, two. Pull, flex your heel in four, three, two. Pull, lift up an inch. Do it again one more time. Reach it all the way out, reach. Hold that nice straight leg in three, two, one. 30 
seconds, little lift and lower. You're here, lift, lower, lift, lower, little squeeze. Woo. All the way out the top of your hair, rock. Out, stay in. So dang good, so dang good. We're gonna go ahead and hit those squats. Woo. We got some hamstrings and some squats to come up, but squats are coming first. Push up. Squeeze and breathe again. 
This heavy band is done in 30 seconds. Get everything you can out of it. Can you widen out that feet? Keep it a little bit more. Hold it, hold it, pause. Slowly press into it as you come up. Don't lock out those legs. I know it's tempting. You can cross. Go for it. <laughs> Woo. Pull on in. All right, all the way down, all the way down. 10 seconds at the bottom. We hold. Five, four, three, two. Hold it here. Down an inch and up. Little press. Eight, seven, six. Find your light band in five. Bungee kicks. Four, three, two, one. Kick that heavy band off. Okay, we're on that repeater side. Right ankle, left foot. Come into the tabletop. Left foot to the ceiling in five, four, whoo. Five that mat up. Three, two, and one. We're here together. Left heel up to the ceiling. So again, that band is on the front of my right ankle. Center the left foot. Four foot square. Point the toe, flex it down. Push up, reach, hold. Come to that 90. Up, reach, hold. Come to 90. Woo! Now, into the bungee, round two. We've already had some lower body movement where we've asked this left leg to work. So you're gonna feel it kick on even sooner. Up for two. Down for one, the heart rate's a little higher. Stay committed to this tempo right here, hold it down an inch. Push it up, two, three, hold, take it down an inch. We're gonna find that hamstring curl. Here we go, 10 seconds left. You're gonna hold it all the way up, point out that toe. Right here in three, two, one, hold it. Hold it, point the toe out, two, Hold it, pause, exhale, pull in. Flex, bend to 90, yeah. Take it out. Pull it in, flex. There we are. Here we go, here we go. Stronger, hey, hey. Flex that heel. Beautiful, that's what we come here to do, to move. It is about that strength, that inner strength that is so much more than that physical strength. It's that mental push right here. When you're tired, show up a little bit stronger. Point that toe out long. In three, two, hold it. Straight leg lift, go up. Lower, final 30 seconds. Here we go, big lift and lower. Lift and lower. Legs are gonna get a recovery. Going into that left oblique. We're gonna start with that band bicycle, single side. In eight, seven, get a little higher with that band, snap it. In four, three, two, and one. All right, come onto that tailbone right here. Place both feet into the band. Right foot holds down to the floor or push it out and away. Take your hands together, reach over that left side. Three, two, let's go, big squeeze. Squeeze, connect, take it out, reach, breathe in, hold, exhale, big push, Woo. squeeze in, if you feel that you're getting more by balancing with that foot up, I want you to do so, if you want to tighten the band, push the heel, plant it down, exhale, take it right back out, hold and pause again, exhale, Try back out. Cover the shoulder blades. Do it right here. Squeeze over. Woo! You got 20 seconds right here. There we go. Big pull. Reach. In eight. We're going to hold it all the way over. A little reaches right here. In four, three, two, go. Reach. Reach. Woo! Mermaid. Right knee down. In four, three, Two, one. We're done with our bands for today. Grab that weight, right knee down to the mat, left toe points out. Reach up to the ceiling. Right away with that combo, drop down. Pull, reach overhead. Take it up to the ceiling. Lift up to pause. Reach up, 
reach on out. Over the ceiling. Woo! Take it back up. Lift up and squeeze. Inhale right back out. All the way, all the way over. Take it up. Exhale, big pause. Woo! Together, we're going to finish out our oblique series. You're in your last five movements of class. Remind yourself, five movements and you're out of here. So take it out. Reach. Pause, big lift on up. Take it right back down. Extend. Woo! Lengthen. Last 10 seconds. No holds, no pulses. Just use that tempo slow, slow. Reach overhead, yes. Feel that left oblique the entire time for four. Dancing bear in three, two, and one. Find your glider right here. Hands go to the mat in four. Woo! In three, two, and one. All right, this time left foot to your glider. Hold on into your high plank. Left feet comes over right elbow. Connect it, hold. Slowly take it back out. Center on that plank. I know you're tired. Keep going. Keep going. Come on. Finish strong. Finish strong. In. Take it out. Last oblique exercise of the day. If you got it, bring both those feet together. Squeeze and draw the knees over to the right elbow. Take it out. Push. Breathe. Hold. Again, right here. Big squeeze. Big twist. Connect. Connect. Breathe. Woo! Take it out. Reach. Lengthen. Shoulders out of the ears right back in 20 seconds. Hold. Twist out. Twist out. Good. I want you to think about bringing out a dish towel with that oblique. Twist it and then pull it in tight. Tight. Get everything out of it. Press it out and away. Woo! One more. All the way in, all the way out. You got it. Last eight. Seven. Six. Five. Step that left foot forward. Single leg squat in three, two, and one. Here we go. Left foot comes up, right toe comes out. Drop down. Single leg squat. Hold at the bottom. Hold a second. Get a little lower. Climb up four. Climb up three. Two, stop before the top. This time it's that left foot. Anchoring all the way down. Putting the weight over into the outside of the heel. Extending out that right toe. So when I face you like this, you're gonna see my right toe coming just off of that right hip, bending back into 90 on the left side. That's what I want you to go for right now. Shoulders are squared. There's so much going on, I know. But you've heard all these cues once before. Can you zone into them a little bit more? Feel the difference. Feel what it feels like to shift more of the weight into the outside of that left heel. That outer glute, outer thigh fires up. What it feels like to hold those low abs in, away from the quad the whole time. To keep that knee behind the toes, sitting back. Nice, long, neutral spine. Slowly climbing up, coming in, stopping before the top, taking it back down. Here we are. Last three movements. Are you ready? Hold this next one down in eight, seven, six, five. Get low in four, three, two. You skate it in. Skate it in. Hold. Push it away. Breathe. Reach. Push it out. Take it back in. Squeeze. And hold. So from that skating, we're pushing out, lengthening out that leg. But you're coming right back into that center. Hold and pause like tippy toe. Exhale. Woo. And there we go. Sit the bear. Together we're gonna fight through this right here. It's the ISO hold. Let's go. Last 10 seconds. Let's add in that upper body. Here we go. In three, two, one. Reach all the way low. Slowly climb up. Stop the hands just in front of the shoulders. Do it again, drop down. Drop down. Hold it, pause, exhale, pull up. Squeeze. Woo. Again, get low. All the way to the bottom, all the way to that reach. That reach, that reach, that hold. That exhale, drag on through. Press down through the outside of the heel. Right down, go low. Woo. Okay, come on. One more to 
together and we're going to take it right back to a curtsy. In six, five, four, three, two, take it up, curtsy right from here. Take that right toe, slide it back behind the left, drop your curtsy. Pull, slowly climb up and breathe. I'm going to face on over, face you one more time. Woo! Left foot locks down, right toe, take it back. Drop down, hold, hold a second here. Right there, yup, it's on. Squeeze it, pull up. Come up, stop before the top, do it again. Hey, get low, get low. When it gets shaky, you turn that shake into a shimmy, you dance it out, and you remember, whew, the joy, the endorphins that are popping into that body right now. Finish it out, be what's waiting for you. At the end of this workout, what's waiting for you when you do not quit, when it gets hard. Hold down to the bottom, take it up, squeeze, cross, and lift. We're here, 18 seconds left of full range, and we're gonna go ahead and tap that knee back into the back of the calf. Eight, seven, six, let's go. Take it down in three, Two right here together. I know it's fighting, I know it's shaking. Bend that back knee in, push it out. Reach, lengthen, cross those legs over, bend it in again, bend it, bend it, pull it. Whatever you do, you got 10 seconds to shake it out. We're gonna reach the hands down. Both toes back to that glider. We got bear with a push up in eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Take those hands down. Step it on back, high plank position, you're here. You're here, you promised yourself 45 minutes of movement. You are down to your last 60 seconds. All together, holding it out. Let's go, roll the shoulders out of the ears. Hold the core in tight. You got this right here, bend the knees in. Bend it in, hold those 90s. Push it all the way out, reach, reach out, and extend. Drop down, exhale, push it up. Take it in, we got three. Turn that down. We're gonna stretch it out. Hell yeah, Tuesday. Nice work, you guys. Whew. Let's slow it down, stretch it out. Grab a quick sip of water. So proud of you guys, showing up, making that time for you. Y'all crush out. If you're staying for stretch, amazing. We're gonna stretch, open it up. If you're taking off, enjoy the rest of your guys. It's Tuesday. You guys, I'll see you guys tomorrow, 7.30. We got 30 minutes of upper body and core. That's why we're a little lighter on the upper body. Tomorrow, we're gonna go a little heavier on the upper body, a little stronger into the center abdominals. And I can't wait to see you guys all tomorrow. Um, let's go ahead and stretch it out. We're gonna hang it in here. Oh, take those legs nice and wide. Send the arms all the way out. Take a deep breath in. Give it a big cactus arms all the way back. Take it up, reach up. Take those hands down to center. Just hold really quick right there. Oh, I'm gonna turn on some stretch music. I'm feeling it today. We're gonna give a nice little five minute stretch right here. So as you guys are hanging out, let's go ahead and bring it in to a
feet in front of you. Slide out the booty chips. Cheeks underneath. Find those nice flat hips into the mat. Take a big inhale overhead. Send the arms over. Hold. Beautiful. Pull and wrap wherever you are. Behind the calf, wherever it is. But wrap and grab onto something. Give a nice big tuck of the chin in. Find a big stretch through in between those shoulder blades. And then take that next one. Lay the chest as far as you can. So finding that nice neutral spine. Flex and pull the toes back towards you. All right, take that last one all the way down. We're gonna come up slowly, rolling one vertebrae on top of another, and breathing. Roll it on up. Gratitude, something you get to do today. Roll those shoulders out. Gratitude for somebody in your life you're a little extra grateful for. Take that last one. Wrap on over. Hug yourself. Do it. Just do it. It always feels great. Give yourself a big squeeze. Gratitude for yourself. Let it go. Again, I will see you guys all tomorrow. Um, for <laughs> I will see you guys all tomorrow. We will have upper body and core. Thank you guys for staying and stretching out with me. I really, really love when you do that. <laughs> yes, Bex. Yes, girl. <laughs> so proud of you. Way to get back on it. You're amazing. Oh, thank you, Kelly. Thank you, Heather. Everybody kicking in. I love it. I love it. You guys are the best. Just the absolute best. All right. Thank you, Jacqueline. Thank you, Brooke. Thank you guys so much for doing this with me. I will see you guys soon. Again, as always, it's huge when you guys can support in the best way is honestly sharing movement, sharing this, and being able to just build this community and connect with others. I absolutely love it. So thank you guys for being a part of it. Seriously, you have my heart. All right, I will have a great Tuesday, and I will see you guys tomorrow.